Welcome back to Mike's Man Cave and welcome back to another bee related video. Now let's have a look at what I've picked up today. I've picked up a Hive Doctor Hive Box or Nuke Box. I've got it on the ground here and this is it here. Um, almost like a plastic cardboard type material. It's got some vents in the side there so you've got some ventilation while transporting your bees. And it's got an entrance at the front there which has got various settings. So you can have it like that so bees can get in and out or you can have a small slot there. I don't think bees will fit through that. Maybe they will. And the queen certainly won't. And then you've got like a ventilation setting there with just a little hole. So when you're transporting the bees, you can have that there and you've got some vents here. It says here, made from recycled material, Hive Doctor. Now this can be used to sell bee swarms. You can also use this to transport bees. The standard bee frames just fit in here with your bees in it. And you can also use these for swarm traps. And I'll be using it for all of the above. Now these are only $19, which is pretty good, I thought. And um, considering like a wooden box similar size is well over $100. So if you're selling bees or transporting bees, this is a nice and cheap way of doing it. And also if you're setting these up as bee traps, it means if it ends up getting stolen, you know, I mean, look, I've never had one getting stolen yet, but then again, I haven't been doing this for very long. But if it ends up getting stolen, well, you've lost $20 instead of a wooden bee box that's worth like $120 upwards. And also, this is probably less likely to get stolen because, you know, these are only $19. That's how much I paid for this one, $19. I've never used one before. The lid seems to fill on quite securely, so I'm hoping once the lid is on, when you're transporting it, the bees can't get out into your car. Now, when I set this up, I will be using the bee feeder inside that with some sugar, water, and honey inside this to attract the bees into the um, swarm box or the nuke box or whatever you like to call it. And there'll also be some standard wooden frames with foundation inside the box. Now, if you have any questions in relation to this um, nuke, hive box, swarm box, whatever you like to call it, don't hesitate to leave your question down below and I will try and answer it to the best of my ability. In the meantime, if you found this video useful or entertaining in the slightest little bit, do me a favor and give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to smash the subscribe button for more videos from Mike's Man Cave. Thanks for watching and bye for now.